again and this time it's with my ipsy bag i haven't done an ipsy unbagging in a while so i thought since i was on a row with videos today i would go ahead and do this one and there's nothing else in the envelope but my bag and i really really like this bag usually not a fan of black and white but in this graphic with the pink zipper i'm loving it it's a, like a canvas bag and it's got a ribbon for the zipper pull and then inside there's a label that says ipsy and op op opa wit i don't know i know i butchered that so ipsy always puts a card in that tells a little bit about i guess the bag or um maybe a theme i'm not quite sure what this card is for it does say create march 2018 and it says this month turn yourself and your world into a work of art redecorate your space mash up two lipsticks to blend your own custom shade which i just talked about in my fab fit fun video so let's see what's in here okay these are markers that say ipsy create and my guess is you can use them to color in your ipsy bag so that's that's neat but i probably won't be doing that and this is by andalou naturals and it's a body lotion this is one of my favorite brands um i have the thousand roses face mist that i just truly love using that mist and I can't wait to try the lotion. In fact, let's smell it. It had a seal on it. Yep, it smells just like the Thousand Roses facial mist that I got. So I'm really super excited to have that. And then this is by Hakari, and it is a cream pigment. I always have trouble getting these little plastic cases open. Don't know why. And this is a really, really pretty shadow. It's like a gold, glittery shadow. And I'm almost thinking I've gotten something. I know I've gotten another eyeshadow from Hakari. I don't know if it's this color. So I'm not going to swatch it in case it is. In fact, the color is called Shine. So I'm happy to have that. And if it is a color I already have, I'll either put it in a giveaway or give it to a family member. So the next thing I see is a Tarte Sex Kitten. And I think that is a liner, an eyeliner. It is. It is a black eyeliner and i don't hurt i i hardly ever use black eyeliner i have so many now that i think i may start experimenting and see if it's really as bad as what i remembered um but i have so many others and i, I if i do use it it won't be very often i'm probably gonna stick this in for a giveaway or a gift to a family member then the next thing is by aurora it's a lip gloss in the color Fairy. And I just noticed the cruel. I just noticed the cruelty free bunny symbol on that. It's a real pretty color. It's like a, um, if I can get it open. It is like a coral peachy color. I love lip gloss. Yeah, it's a lip gloss. I love lip gloss and I love this color. So I can see me using this during the summer and I keep my lip gloss in my right pocket of my jeans or my shorts if it's summer. And this is a smaller, a smaller one and it'd be perfect for that. And then the last thing is by Glossier. It is a coconut balm. I'm assuming this is like a lip balm. And it's just in a little squeezy tube. And 
It is a really thick, it's really thick balm. And there's a slight scent. It's not much to, it's not much of a scent. So if you don't like scents, I don't think you would mind this one. It's not that, it's not overpowering at all. So that's everything in this month's Ipsy bag. I truly liked everything except the black eyeliner. I, I am good about going in and reviewing my bag every month. I know I've put in that I don't want black eyeliner. And I'm pretty sure I have mentioned not wanting mascara. And I don't think I've gotten a mascara in a while. Um, they do know that I love hand lotion and I get hand lotion quite often. Um, they do know I love lip gloss. So I've, I've gotten lip gloss before. And I love eyeshadows. So I think for me, they have been paying attention to my feedback and my reviews on my items to know to and to be able to tailor the bag towards that um from what i understand they just have a select amount of products every month so if they've got to fit all your likes and dislikes with just a set amount of products they may not hit the mark every single time but if i like three of the items and the other two items i can donate put in a giveaway or a gift to friends and family so Ipsy's a hit for me I'm yet I've yet to be tired of it I took a look at what I was subscribed to at the beginning of the year and I canceled glossy box and I'm going to cancel Allure I do like Allure but I'm getting so many products that I can't go through them fast enough so I needed to back off and I'm just going to keep the ones that I truly love Fat Fit Fun, Boxy Charm, Ipsy I do like Sephora Play, but it would be the next one to go if I decide to get if I decide to get rid of another one. But it's more, at least for me, it's more skincare and hair products, which I don't seem to get in the other boxes. So I think I'll probably be hanging on to it for a while. So that's everything that I got in my bag this month. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, go ahead and do so. I hope to be posting more often. I hope you have a great day. Bye-bye.